All right, Brian Particelli, 2Fab.com here. Pleasure to be speaking with you both today. Hello. Um, I am a big fan of the show, and I don't know how you are able to keep everything running so smoothly. I know this season you're adding another timeline to it all. I'm just, how fun and challenging is it when you do decide to take on something like that? You know, you already have this show that has multiple timelines, and now we're throwing a third one in with, you know, Roger and Buck headed back in time previous to what we've seen before. <laughs> um, again, when you first see it, you know, when when we first start breaking it, you, you know, you, you take a big, you know, breath and go, how are we going to do this? But what really helped us out is that um, Roger and Buck are in Scotland um, and Brianna's in Scotland. And even though it's a different time period, it's uh, we can go out our back door because we film in Scotland. So that really helped if this if they were in two different locations, you know, not Scotland, then it would have been very, very challenging. We would probably had to um, truncate one of those stories. But the fact is that that made it um, I'm not going to say easier for us, but it made it less challenging because then, you know, of course, it had to be the 80s and then 70 or 39 and then, you know, the 1780s in America. You know, I mean, all that is when you're filming a day and you are to, you know, you go, Oh, this is where we are today. This is where we are tomorrow. You know, that becomes challenging for the art department and even the care, you know, the actors going from one period to another. So. And can you talk a little bit about bringing Lata and Graham back this season? Just how much fun do you have working with them and kind of playing with the situation kind of every time we've seen them? I mean, it was so, I mean, anytime we can bring back original cast members, I mean, I think we miss everyone. I mean, there's so many people from the first season that we haven't seen in so long. And, um, you know, Graham and Lotta are so much fun. And to also see them in a new way, something we haven't seen before, and to go back and see a scene maybe that, um, you know, to get to see her interact with um, family members um, is is a lot of fun. So, um, I think, you know, they're lovely people in real life and, and they're fan favorites. So to bring them back is, you know, was definitely something we knew we had to do. And, you know, I know the show recently wrapped completely on season eight and series as a whole. Just what was it like? I'm assuming you both were on set for that last day when they said, and that's it, that's a wrap. That's a wrap on everything. Just what starts going through your head? I mean, well, it's. It's, you know, obviously a, a very emotional. Meryl and I have been on the show from day one, so 12 years, going on 13. Um, you know, for, for me, I think knowing that I have so much post and, and post-production and editing and to go that, that it's not really over. And I like to think that the episodes are over when the fans see them. Um, mm. uh, Meryl was, you know, I'll let her explain what a big pile of goose she was. <laughs> I, I sobbed. I mean, if there was a contest about who got the most emotional this season, I would win it hands down. I mean, I was emotional okay. first read through and I did not stop. So <laughs> I cried every time we wrapped somebody out. I, um, I sobbed on the last day. I thought, you know, so many things have happened over the last 12 years, you know, I had kids. I had, you know, um, it's just been kind of a, a game changer and a life changer for so many of us that um, yeah. you know, our family, I know that term gets thrown around quite a bit in this industry, but it's really true on this show. So it's, it's the literal end of an era. So um, it was very emotional. I get I'm to sure we'll be talking. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, I'm sure we'll be talking to you again next season about it as well, but thank you for everything. It's always a pleasure and yeah, have a good one. Thanks, Brian.